Hi, are you relocating the Red Star Arsenal with one of the companies such as FBI, U.S. Army Corps of Engineer, Missile Defense, U.S. Army Contracting, Boeing, or even NASA, or any of the other jobs that are hosted within Red Star Arsenal? If so, please stay tuned. <laughs> bikes with exit realty north and today i want to share with you five things that you should know when relocating to red zone art number one your housing options your housing options are numerous and they're varied depending on your lifestyle the type of house or style of home that you would like to live in or for whatever type of land that you would like to have whatever is important to you here in Huntsville, Alabama, we have it. So for example, if you prefer more of a downtown or more of an urban feel, and you like to be able to walk to your entertainment or to the grocery store or to any of the fine dining that is offered to you, then guess what? We offer that here too. You can look in the areas of downtown Huntsville in a neighborhood such as the medical district, or you can look over in Providence Enjoy the beautiful row homes that give you that up north community that is within walking distance of Providence and they are serviced by many entertainment opportunities out there such as restaurants, small pubs, some boutique shopping, pizza, and one of the popular restaurants around, around here, Taco Mama, as well as many community activities such as outdoor um, parks and as well as movie in the park. We also have areas that are rural. You can have anything from a planned community all the way up to a farm. And you would want to look in the areas of Harvest, Tony, Gurley, or Meridianville and maybe even Owens Crossroad. If you are into mountain living, I highly recommend Green Mountain, McMullen Cove, and Monsanto. It has beautiful homes up there. A lot of them are custom made and they offer beautiful breathtaking views and it is absolutely gorgeous when and if we get snow to have that view of the city and the snow. We also offer townhome communities that are um, maintenance free. So if maintenance free living is something that you are looking into or would like to have, we do offer that here. Everything that I mentioned in terms of homes are gonna be down below in a link. Feel, please feel free to connect and look around and do a search for the community of your choice. Number two, we offer great schools. So if you are interested in schools that offer blue ribbon, we have those here. If you are interested in magnet programs, we also offer those here. If you are interested or your children are interested in STEM programs, we offer those here. And there are also schools available for the arts here. Now, if you are into private school, private school is a very strong and viable option here. They have them all the way from religious or faith-based private schools all the way into special need private schools for children who may um, have autism or ADHD or um, any other type of special needs that may need to be addressed. We have schools that service them here too. If college is a necessity, we have four major colleges that service this area along with a few others in outlying areas. We have the University of Alabama in Huntsville. We have Oakwood University. We have Alabama A&M. We have Calhoun Community College, as well as a little ways down the road, Athens State University and North Alabama, and the University of North Alabama, um, which is not too far away in Florence. So in terms of education, the opportunity is numerous here and they all service this area in terms of the STEM and technological needs of the area. So what the community puts out, the school um, takes in and gives it back. So there's a lot of good juicy things going on within our school system. The links to those will be down below. 
Number three, we, we offer great entertainment. If you enjoy things such as hiking, mountain trails, camping, um, arcades, golfing, we have Robert Trent Jones Golf Trails here. We have golf, we have Top Golf. We also have Dave and Buster. We also have um, Stars and Strikes. They are a great bowling community arcade. Um, we have a lot of activities here downtown in the Low Mills area. There's always some type of concert or some type of festival going on in Big Spring Park. It's always an exciting time of the year, starting in the as early as spring, running all the way into late fall when it comes down to the Low Mills and Big Spring Park community area because there's always so many wonderful opportunities and festivals going on downtown. So if you like getting outside and experiencing festivals, then they're, they're here and they're for you to have. Um, we also have boating. There's a lot of rivers and fishing here. So we are surrounded by two rivers, the, front, the Flint River and the Tennessee River. So if boating is your thing, then we also have that here too. If fishing, we're not that far away from Lake Gunnersville. You're looking at maybe a 40 minute drive to Lake Gunnersville um, from the Huntsville area. And you can enjoy many lazy days on the lake of just drifting away and enjoying the waves, enjoying the breeze, and hey, even jumping in and taking a nice swim. There is a drivable zoo here. So if you like playing with the animals and enjoying that, some of the farms, they open up and they give farm tours. They also um, allow you to pick some of your own fruit. And um, in the fall time, they offer pumpkin and hay rides. So that's really exciting and awesome to do. So we have entertainment. There are things that you can do or that you can learn to do or that you can learn to enjoy. Um, number four, we offer the travel convenience. And when I say travel convenience, how close are we to other areas that you may want to be um, traveling to or be a part of? For example, Nashville. We are an hour and a half drive from Nashville. We are an hour and a half drive from Birmingham and Chattanooga. We are three hours drive to Atlanta. So if those are areas that interest you in terms of entertainment or you want to visit or you want an idea of how conveniently close you are to those areas, then they're not that far. They're within a reasonable drive. Um, you can do a quick turn around day trip and you know be back before nightfall is Huntsville is a very conveniently close area to a lot of different opportunities um, also number five is connected to really number one is your property taxes and your HOAs it's not a very expensive place to live in terms of property taxes and HOA if you are in a self-maintained community, your HOAs are going to run different a little bit where you're dealing with a month-to-month -month fee or maybe even a, a, an additional quarterly fee um, on top of your HOA. But in general, um, if you're outside of a self-maintained community and you're in a planned community um, neighborhood where they have an HOA, then your fees are going to vary based upon that community, but those fees are generally due only once a year. Whereas in a self-maintained community um, where you have people who are taking care of your lawn, your building maintenance, your, um, your watering of your yard, and things of that nature that actually take care of the community, then those communities are either going to have a, an additional monthly fee or they're going to have an additional quarterly fee. It just really depends on which community you choose. Now let's get into your property taxes. Property taxes here are not that expensive. Those two um, are only pretty much paid once a year. Um, they come due every year around October time frame. So if that is something that you're concerned about, don't be too overwhelmed because once again, Alabama has some of the lowest state property taxes in the country and um, so let's 
put that in terms of a number if your house is approximately two hundred and fifty thousand dollars then you're probably looking at maybe about twelve to fifteen hundred in property taxes for the year not the month but the year so we have some of the most inexpensive property taxes in the country okay so property taxes are not going to be that expensive so if you would like to have uh, more information if you like everything that you heard in this video i ask that you will please hit the subscribe button um, i will be posting here every thursday more videos about the area and things that you should know as well as other information about purchasing homes here within the area again i am aisha bikes with exit realty north and i thank you for tuning in have a great day